Hey everybody, Skylar here, and today I- Wait, 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 okay. Before we get started on this video, I just wanted to say, I know a lot of you just have a quick question. You don't want to watch this, like, really long video, so that's completely fine. If you have a quick question, uh, go down below and comment, and I will answer your question pretty much right away. I get notifications on my phone right when someone comments. It normally pops up within a couple minutes. Um, I will respond pretty much right away, um, and, and that way you don't have to watch a really long video. And I know I'm supposed to push, like, the YouTube algorithm of watching videos, and that's what helps with it again. Or, or whatever but um, hey if you like and subscribe this video that will help me a lot and by the way um, I also have timestamps down, down below if so if you want to push through the video with those timestamps look you know check those out so that that might help with your time but uh, but at any rate any video I, I do like this just just I, I make these videos to help you I've been in the crypto space for years um, and I just want you know if you have any questions any any anything I'll just let you know like hey what to be aware of this place is filled with like nasty people that are ripping everybody off and and um, and and yeah so uh, I'm, I'm here to help your journey if you're new into this space liking and subscribing absolutely isn't a bad idea by the way all of my the profits I ever make with this name goes to charity so you know there's that I don't know but at any rate hopefully for the rest of you this answers any of your questions um, and uh, yeah hope, enjoy the video I'm going to uh, bring you an update on everything that is XIO that has happened uh, the company the algorithm changes the the sentinel dropping the sentinel sharing the uh, the bridges the um, the basic plan the plus plan the pro plan the no sentinels the um, I tested everything I'm gonna kind of go over everything uh, on this video today hopefully uh, I can do this in a reasonable time however I've recorded this like five times and I keep it keeps taking like an hour so I'm gonna try to fly through this a lot quicker and edit it down but uh, but at, at any rate um, let me Let's start from the very beginning, all right? Most people want to know, um, right, what's the cheapest way I can invest, where I can make money. Now, I'm not going to talk about not doing an XYO Sentinel just because if you don't use an XYO Sentinel, there's kind of no point. Um, you're going to make a few bucks a year and it's not going to be worth it. So um, I, let me talk about what, what would happen if you bought just one XYO Sentinel. So if you go to the XYO website, it looks something like this. You can end up popping into their website and uh, right when you, you just type XYO network and it'll pull up this site right here. Um, for some reason, the mining kit, they say you can buy a geo mining kit, but I haven't actually seen you able to buy it. It only offers this free Sentinel, free Sentinel. <laughs> so I don't know if they even offer the, 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 uh, the bridge with the eight Sentinels anymore. Um, which is interesting because, uh, you know, I was one of the early investors and I, there's a lot of early investors that w when you are one of the first people to invest and you invest mo way more than people that invest later, you kind of expect to get something better than everybody else, right? But people that are starting today are getting better deals than people that, that were the very first um, people that started um, using this product. So. Now the mining algorithm has changed a little bit, so I guess that is one thing that uh, that, that now new users are getting less and less. You're, you're getting less and less coins. The mining algorithm just changed when they came out with that basic and pro plan, and it dropped at about 20 to 25 percent. Um, in fact, if you look at my last video, you see that I made about 455 coins if I left a, a device on mining at home 24 hours a day, um, and now that that has dropped down to about 333 on average. So it has um, one, and I, I tested it three times, and it's always in between 20 to 25 percent drop from what I what I did before. So the mining algorithm has changed, but uh, but before I get into that, that free sentinel, let's just talk about that that um, the mining algorithm really quick and how much money you actually make on it. So first of all, let's just go to um, Coin Market Cap. Right. Um, and we're going to go to XYO. Whoops. X, Y, O. So, uh, something to note, I guess, is we have been seeing all-time lows. I invested right about when it was like 0 .002, and it has been going down ever since. And pretty much on a on a every few days, we're seeing a new uh, a new uh, all-time low. So, but uh, it isn't dropping that dramatic. I mean, kind of a little bit, but. Uh, but let's let's kind of uh, see how much it would it would cost um, in order to make it worth it buying a sentinel. So first of all, if you end up buying a sentinel, you can get one of these sentinels. Um, in fact, right here, once you go to the website and you click on it, it'll end up being twelve ninety five. 
So $12.95 is what one Sentinel would cost, and then $67 would give you four more. Um, so uh, $12.95 plus uh, $67 is about $80. So $80 will give you, will end up giving you four um, Sentinels, uh, which is about $20 a pop on a Sentinel. Um, but uh, let's just talk about the $12.95 for one, and then we can go into the others. So um, XYO is currently at 0 .000776. Um, so uh, $12.95 Sentinel. Now, if you had a phone and you left it at home mining 24-7, you'd make about 333 coins uh, a day. That being said, some people don't have phones, and I understand that some people don't have phones um, that they just have laying around. I ran into a guy who had a busted up LG uh, phone, an old one, and LG phones I like because they uh, the screens can t stay turned on forever on most of them. Um, there's no like, after an hour, 30 minutes, 10 minutes, doesn't dim, dim down. Um, although some devices, as long as they're plugged in and the program is open, it won't dim down as well, but uh, at any rate, uh, I'm not including the cost of phone because I have tons of phones that I can use. I just have phones all over the place, old phones, junk phones. Um, but if you can get an old LG phone, doesn't matter if there's a cracked screen, all that matters is it can connect to Wi-Fi um, and, uh, and that it turns on. <laughs> and, and then you can download the coin app as well. But So if it's a smartphone, you should be good. Um, so now that being said, if you did drive for 30 minutes, I did average about 59 coins um, per 30 minute drive. So uh, you can also use that into your calculations, but I'm gonna use the, um, I'm gonna use a 333 for now, and then I'll, I'll, I'll do the uh, 30 minute drive depending, and then we'll see what, where the money, how, where the money lays. So we're gonna take the daily, the, uh, the um, 333 coins, and we're gonna times that by 0.000776. And that equals out to be about 25.8, about 25 cents, almost 26 cents um, per day that you get for mining 24 seven. So if we're gonna times that by, whoops, I didn't mean to say 60, times that by 30, we're looking at about $7.70. So if you bought a Sentinel and you left it laying out on your desk 24 um, with a phone mining 24 hours a day on the free plan, you're going to make about $7.70, 75 cents. Uh, every single month, which means, you know, after two months, you're going to be at about $15 and 50 cents. Now, if this coin keeps declining, we might be at that around 13 bucks here in, in the next month or two, and maybe more, I don't know, but it hasn't declined, you know, 50% in, in, in three months. So we just know, so even if it continues its decline, you might not get it back in two months, but you'll get it back in three or four. So I also mine cryptocurrencies outside of, I, I actually have a mining rig, and I'm gonna break even in about a year and a half. Um, and so, and if, if you do any investments outside of, uh, you know, if you are if you do any investments, you, you should know that getting your money back in two months, three months, four months, six months, a year is freaking amazing. So, um, yeah, now, I also don't want to, you know, I'm only talking about money. I'm not talking about the legitimacy of the company or the people behind it or anything like that. I'll get into all that later in my opinions, by the way, their opinions that, that needs to be clarified. Um, but uh, I'm, I'm only talking about, hey, if we just, from where the money stands right now and where all the mining algorithm is sitting right now, if we mined, um, how much money would we make? And yeah, if you mine 24 hours a day on a device with one cent and all that you pay 12.95 for, after two months at its current price, you would make $15.50. So, um, is it worth it? I don't know. So, um, now let's talk about the other Sentinels, right? Um, you can get a couple more Sentinels. Would it be worth it to buy these Sentinels now? So, oh, let's take that 30 minute drive as well, right? So, um, 30 minutes is a 30 minute drive. Now I'm just assuming you at least have a 30 minute commute every single day to work. 15 there, 15 back, maybe it's 30 there, 30 back. But hey, if you drive an hour and a half and whatever this number, just know it's, it's three times whatever this number I'm giving you. Uh, I just wanted to kind of crank it down as less, as kind of a, a smaller number as I could so, so then everybody can kind of take this number and add on to what they actually do. Uh, I did this three times by the way, so um, 
Also, uh, XYLS says it doesn't matter where you're at in the world, doesn't matter. I thought if you went into like the mountains and some like cool pass that nobody's on that maybe you'd get more, but that's not the case. So whether you're a truck driver only driving on freeways, by the way, if you're a truck driver, it's for sure worth it to buy a bunch of cent, buy at least buy one Sentinel, but we'll get into that later. Um, at any rate, so these other, so these other Sentinels, um, so we can get three more for 65 bucks, ends up being about 20 bucks a pop. So even if we were doing that 20 bucks a pop, you're still making that, you know, seven, you're still making 15 bucks every, every, um, every uh, two months. So you'd make your money back in, in three months. But let's see, let's see that uh, 30 minute drive. So we are going to take, uh, where are my notes? We're gonna take that 30 minute drive, which ends up being 59 coins. And we're gonna times that by 0 0.000776. That equals be four pennies and, and five cents. We're gonna times that by 30. Now I know that you don't drive every single day of the month, but when you're not working, maybe you hang out with friends, take a drive, I don't know. I would think a 30 minute commute every single day is pretty reasonable. Um, even if some people don't drive for like three days in a row, maybe they drive an hour and a half the next day, I don't know. So at this rate, if you were only driving 30 minutes a day, you'd make about $1.30 um, every single month. So we times that by 12, you're at 16 bucks. So um, I have on my phones right now, uh, I have one that has the pro app and one that doesn't have the pro app and I'm gonna go into both of them and kind of show you, sorry, the plus plan, not the pro. So um, let's talk about the plans really quick. So if I hop into the plans, you're gonna see one of my plans is already on the plus, one of them is on the basic. If I wanna upgrade, it, it, it tells me I have to pay $24.95. Now, some people upgraded when the price is only $12.95. Um, you're gonna, supposedly you keep that price, you're gonna keep that price. However, if you wanna upgrade to the Pro, it tells me that I have to pay $12.12 .12 or a proration, but it's a proration of, of uh, yeah, $6.29. So it's telling me that I can increase to the next plan for the $12, but, um, but I don't know if that's actually true. It, is, am I gonna get the plus the pro plan? Since I already paid the $12.95, are they gonna charge me $24.95 um, on the plan? So on the, on the plan I already paid for? So right now you're grandfathered in. If you already bought the $12.95, you're gonna have the $12.95 for a year. Now, they say that you make 2X or 3X. In fact, let's go um, and actually see what's, uh, what you get with it. And so on the free one, yeah, you get, you know, times one on the geo mining speed, the recharge rate, the likelihood for big geo mines, the 12 times the reward. Uh, you don't, um, no additional geo mining rewards. You get auto collect, you get the coin account and you get geo dropping. Now on the coin plus, they tell you that you get a, uh, they tell you that you get two times geo mining speed, and that's not accurate. It's it's more, by the way. Um, so on the 24 hours before before they went to these plans, I mined about 455 coins every 24 hours. Uh, now that the plan is out, I am mining uh, every 24 hours about 966. So if I take 455 times two, we're at 910. So I'm getting about 56 more coins every 24 hours um, than I should if it was actually a straight up 2X. Now I've done this test over three days, I'm still getting more than 2X every single time. Um, I haven't tried the, the 3495 plan yet, the 3X. Um, I don't think I'm actually going to. And maybe if, you, if, if I get a lot of requests, if people don't want me to do more testing, I will. Um, but yeah, now the recharge rate, people say uh, the recharge rate used to be 8.8 .8 seconds. So um, if you go to, yeah, my last video, I actually have where I posted the recharge rate. 8.7 seconds. So it was 8.7 seconds for a charge on my last video. And uh, let's see what it is now. Boom. So 
so 6.36 seconds it's not twice as fast <laughs> but it is a little faster uh, so let's go back to the details so the uh, two times charge rate okay it's not quite two times charge rate so that's unfortunate um, now maybe when you're driving it will be because when you're driving I don't know no it still takes a minute after it collects before it rewinds so I don't know now the two-time likelihood of big geo mines. So I've been paying for the basic plan essentially right when it came out, and since then I have received two uh, big-ish geo mine drops. Uh, one was 577, and one was 911. Uh, that being said, when I was paying for the free account, I was um, I actually made a 2,500 geo drop, which was way bigger than any of the geo drops I've had on the paid one combined. So they say that you get twice the amount of likelihood. Um, I don't know what the like. I don't know if I'm actually getting 2x. Uh, but it is interesting that I've received 2500 when I wasn't paying for it and now that I am paying for it I haven't got a geo drop anywhere close to that um, But I did get two a month instead of one so I guess it is twice as much just not as much I don't know. I'm sure if I test this for 12 months the numbers might be a little more appealing to uh, to look at that 2x or, or whatever but uh, But in the month I've had recording this is the numbers I've got um Monthly geo drop, maybe that's what I got. My monthly geo drop. Uh, the auto collect isn't the auto collect also on this one? Yeah, it is on the free one. Um, and then the coin account, which you get in the free and the geo dropping, uh, which you get in the free. So the free one, yeah, um, it's not that bad to get the tw you know, the free one is the numbers I, I've been giving you this entire video actually. So you getting, you know, you're that. Sentinel paid back in two months is with this basic now um, And then the coin pro is gonna be 34 and it's gonna be three times so you know, it's interesting because They told me I would be grandfathered into paying $12 But as I went to the app and tried to upgrade to coin pro it told me it's going to be $12.71 more, which makes me think that they're saying, oh, it's only $12.71 from the 24, but since you're paying the 12, it's actually gonna be double that, but maybe not. So Coin Pro, oh, you can get Coin Pro now. So I'm, I'm not going to buy Coin Pro and test it. Maybe I will for one month. Maybe I'll try the Coin Pro just for a couple days just to see and then, then take it off or something. But anyways, those are the plans. Um, now, let's talk about if it's going to be worth it for you um, to get the Coin Pro or the Coin Plus. And so here's pretty much the math. Um, let's go to XYO. Okay, so let's see what it would take to... Um, get $24.95 worth of XYO, right? So we're gonna go 24.95 and we're gonna divide that by 0 .000770 and that equals 32402. So 32,402. Um, that's how much XYO coins that you would end up getting. So now you have 32,000 XYO coins. Um, now we are going to divide that uh, which we divide that by 30, right? So 1,080. So if you are not mining 1,080 coins every single day um, already on the free account, then it's not worth it to get the 2495, right? Um, which I for sure am not mining that much. I'm mining about 800, but I'm not mining over that. So the way that I'm doing things, it's not worth it for me to even get the 24.95. Now, if XYO goes up, I mean, if it goes back up to its 0 .002, um, that's not even its all-time high. That's just you know where it's been steady at the most. Then um, you know that it might be worth it again for me. So um, you know, let's even take the 34.95. Let's divide that by 0 .000770, and we're at 45,000 whatever divided by 30. That's 1,500. So if you're not already mining 1,500 coins every single day um, on the.
free account, then it's not worth it. It would be cheaper to go to KuCoin and then just spend the $34.95 on the XYO and then hold it or whatever. So let's talk about geodropping really quick. In fact, let's uh, geodrop. Here we go. Let's geodrop some coins. So when you're on your coin account, all you gotta do is hit the uh, the your top little X Y O button guy, and it's gonna show you how many coins you have. And then you can either well withdraw. There's your with, there's another withdrawal button right there. Um, or you can geodrop. So I'm gonna geodrop. No activities. All right, let's do a new one. How much do you want to geo drop? All right, well, let's do. Let's do a thousand. Oh, let's do five hundred. Two hundred. Oh, that's cool. It has a little bar. So let's do a hundred X Y O. Three hundred. Why not? We're gonna do it on the current tile. Oh yeah, we don't want to do any current tile. Restrictions to email, no, note. Skastruck. Crypto. It's all lowercase because I'm a small channel. <laughs> so. Fee, oh, it's free for a limited time. Oh man, I do not like that. They're gonna be charging for, for geo-dropping. Okay. So I'm gonna hit done. Now as you see, it's gonna pop a little square. It's gonna take away my, my little miners. Now, it may take a little bit, but as you see, boom, it just popped up on the other device, and now I can collect it. So I boom, I collect it. I get my regular 244, my 2.44 coins, and then I hit the little geo drop. Boom, collected 300 XYO, congrats. You found 300 XYO in a geo box. Note from sender, Skystro Crypto. Oh look, in the other phone I got a little note. Let me hit the note. Geo drop received, success. One of your geo drops has been collected, nice. Okay, so let's talk about Sentinel sharing now. So, uh, as you see on my screen, if you go to the top right, uh, I have a crown because I have a plus plan. However, if I'm not paying for the plus plan, then uh, that crown won't be there. It'll just kind of look like a person. Um, okay, so let's talk about these sentinel sharings. So first of all, uh, I know you see a bunch of sentinels uh, connected, and they're all getting a little bit, and some are getting kind of a lot uh, of XYO coins. Now, most of these coins are just uh, me that I have a bunch of sentinels at home um, that have just been sitting in the drawer. So most of these are just mining a little bit, but the uh, Mike Wazowski one, that one has actually been, um, the Mike Wazowski one has actually been uh, mining my phone that's been mining on Wi-Fi 24 seven, mostly. Uh, and in the Oz, sometimes I do little tests in the car when my wife is driving, that's her Sentinel. Um, and, uh, and, and I, I make a little bit off of hers. The White Widow, I don't know where that's at actually. Um, I can't remember, but I, I don't have my notebook with me I, where I gave them out to. But that being said, the White Rhino, that's one I want to talk about. So, the White Rhino is a Sentinel, is one of these Sentinels that I gave, um, to somebody that's mining 24 hours a day just like me and they're mining about 333 coins uh, on average every single day so um, they've been doing it for like a week or so I'm not sure I can't remember how about a week so six days ago six days ago exactly I gave um, maybe six and a half I guess days ago I gave a sentinel to somebody and they have been mining 24 hours a day making about 333 coins uh, a day on average um, while having that sentinel. So I've made about 214 XYO coins just by getting that 10%. Now let's actually see if it actually is 10%. So we go to that little graph 
and we are going to see little, uh, uh, it's going to show us the last five days. So let's actually do some math here. So, okay, let me, let me explain the math I'm going to do here real quick. So if this, if this phone, uh, this other phone is mining about 333 coins a day, then, um, then 333 times five days equals 1665. So 10% 10 times 0 0.10 is 166. So if I make more than 166 coins, then um, after when I add all these up, then I'm making at least 10%, uh, which it says right here, right? Sentinel sharing earn 10% of others geo mining. So 333 a day, mining 24 hours. By the way, that being said, there should be some leeway as well because uh, for some reason my location gets errored out and sometimes I like, like, like what if at like midnight or one my location goes out and I don't notice it's like eight in the morning. Well, I just missed a, a ton of hours. So um, I would say, you know, sometimes you, you, it's not actually mining the full 24 hours a day, but, but yeah. So let's, so this white rhino for the last five days, if, if we take these five days and we, we add them up, it should equal up to be around 166, give or take, you know, maybe 10% of that number, depending on the phone not being on every once in a while. Um, my phone errors out about every two and a half days, and I don't know how long it is when I catch it, but hopefully I catch it pretty soon. Uh, but okay, so let's take uh, this white rhino and do the last five days and see if it equals out to be around 166. So 16.38 plus 45 plus 69.25 plus 25.47 plus 26.33 plus 36.36 equals out to be 114. Did I do that wrong? 16.38 plus 45.69 plus 25.47 plus 2. 26.33 plus 36.36 equals 150. So I am making a little bit less than 10%. However, there is that leeway. So I would say it's probably accurate, maybe accurate. I have earned 216 though, and I for sure they didn't get it before. It was no more than seven days. Um, so I mean, we take that 216, we divide it by seven, we're at about 30, so 30 would be a little under as well, right? 333 would be a little under 10% as well. So who knows if you're actually making the full 10%, but that's what I got from the last five days. So I was going to show you how to add a sentinel. However, it's showing that a bridge is not found. And to be honest, that's really frustrating because I currently have um, I wonder if this information is sensitive. <laughs> I currently have the bridge on my app up right now. Uh, I, I currently also have uh, my t <laughs> my television has the monitor on my X on my XYO app or the, my bridge. So my television is actually hooked up right now to my bridge, and I have a separate bridge that's going on my phone. However, when I try to connect my Sentinel, it tells me... Oh, my Sentinels are gone. There they go. It says that a bridge X isn't found. So, I do have my bridge plugged in. It's turned on, it's turned on. So, maybe it's just an error and it'll work eventually. But, as you see, I've, I've connected a, both, a bunch of them and all these connected are fine. So I'm, I'm assuming that it's just an error in the system that'll fix itself. But once you add it, all it'll have you do is hit, take this little button on the side and it'll have you press it twice. Then after you press it twice, it'll connect. It'll ask you if you want to name it. And then, um, and I think, let's see, does it ask for, it has, but you put in two things, like who you're giving it to and what you name it maybe. Maybe it's just one thing. Anyways, you give it that description and then you hit done. And then it's gonna appear on your phone uh, and then you're going to be able to see it uh, uh, on your device under the Sentinel sharing, and then you can actually give one of these devices out to friends and make around 10%. Uh, to be honest, I actually did the math on this uh, earlier, um, a day ago, or 
or two days ago or something, and it w was it was like 10.8 percent, I think. So maybe if I did a bigger over 30 days, it might will it might be 10 10 percent. So um, I'm gonna give the I, I feel like I should give them that because uh, they have been really generous on the the rewards, right? If you don't have a Sentinel, they say you get 12 times more. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you saw my last video, but uh, I went, I did about 20 hours of driving with the coin app opened without a Sentinel, and I made uh, about 77 coins. Then I got a Sentinel, I drove for 20 minutes, and I, I made more than 77 coins in that 20 minutes. So, um, so yeah. So now that we've talked about how much rewards you would get. So now I, I can't like really answer everybody specifically on this video if it makes sense for you. All I can say is like, here's the time frame, here's the math. You figure out how much you can actually have the coin app open mining to make it worse and make sense to you. Okay, this is going to be the last section of the video. I actually wasn't going to put this in, but as the video was actually loading on YouTube, I realized uh, that there was an update to the app. I updated it, and now there are these changes. So <clears throat> I've been testing these changes for almost a full day now. Um, uh, I'm like uh, tw at 20 hours, 21 hours into it, and I kind of wanted to go over the changes. So. Um, I'll just so first of all, this little sentinel on the top left, a little icon up here. Now it's a sentinel, but it doesn't do anything different. Just the icon is a sentinel now. But uh, what I want to talk to you is the the icons below. So first of all, um, the bottom left, that little parachute is a, is a geo drop. Normally you'd have to tap the little XYO symbol in the, in the top middle screen. It would take you to this section. You type geo drops. You go to add geo drop, and then you can add it. Um, but you can just hit the bottom left, that little parachute, and it's just going to hop it right in. Um, it's just going to hop right into it. So. Uh, make it a little quicker so you can geo drop, uh, and then the other thing right here is the uh, the, the little f uh, purple flag. So uh, interesting thing. <laughs> wow, 26 owners now. Um, when I first did this, there was only six owners uh, in this little section, and now there's 26. My my ownership went from like 32, 34 percent, something like that, down to four. But he here's the deal with this. So. Uh, where you are at, it's going to pull up a 25 by 25 square area. Um, this gets refreshed every single week, and on Monday morning, you will be able to um, take more ownership. So essentially what takes place is uh, every Monday, it shows in the top right of the little square, I have three days left. Um, so in three days, uh, all of these ownerships and the XYO earned and everything is going to erase. And then um, you'll see in the bottom left that 100 XYO. <clears throat> so uh, for you can put in XYO and the more people that put in, it depends on how much is totally put in this 25 by 25 square. And, um, and uh, so it shows that there's 26 owners right now and I'm getting 4% so the 1200 that I put in is 4% of all the XYO that was put in over the 26 owners and it shows I'm ranked number six so it's five people who put more than 1200 coins in um, and if you look at the very very bottom right you see um, 100.91 so that's how much XYO I have earned in the last 24 hours by putting in that 1200 XYO. Now this test is, I can't test it for everybody because every place is gonna be different. Uh, I could be in Los Angeles and there could be 120 owners and it might be really hard to get ownership, but that means there's also more people mining in that area. So the rewards might equal out to be around the same, I don't know. But here's how it works. So. Uh, you get 10% of every single um, XYO coin that has been mined in this 25 by 25 area. Um, and since I own 4%, essentially I have a 4% chance to earn 10% of all the XYO earned. So you've actually know you should notice that while I recorded this, I actually got a little bit, but uh, um, but yeah. So uh, I again, I'll say it again. Um, I, since I have a 4% ownership, I have a 4% chance to earn 
So um, four percent of the time, I'm gonna I'm gonna be the one that earns that ten percent rewards, and the other amount of the time, the other twenty five owners are gonna get that ten percent. So um, if I did this over uh, seven days, and I'm like I said, I'm right at that twenty four hour mark, um, then I would have made about seven hundred XYO, which means. Um, you see, I, I paid twelve hundred, which means I put I'll be putting in more XYO than I'll actually earn. And like I said, the last twenty four hours there was only I think there was nine or seven or something when um, when I closed this out last night. And since then, twenty you know there's been almost twenty people that have that have joined in. So it you know it may be worth it, it may not. I'm gonna put at least hundred XYO every single week just to kind of see what the numbers look like and kind of see if it calms down or more people mine or I don't know, just to kind of see. But you also see of the 26 owners, there's been 1,830 XYO tokens mined um, in the last, it's been about 24 hours since this uh, update came out. Now, that 1,200 that I paid, I am not going to get it back. It, it gets taken away and then on this coming Monday, if I want to get more ownership, I have to give up some more of my XYO in order to uh, get an ownership of that area. You also can hit that info button on the left uh, and it will take you to a Q&A and it will answer all of your questions. Uh, so, um, so if you want to know more information, you can go in there. Again, you can just ask me in the comments and I'll just reply to you uh, quickly in the comments. But uh, I have uh, looked on, uh, on Twitter and kind of see what other people have got. And uh, there actually is this guy who has who received 320 XYO tokens um, in the past 24 hours. So there are some places where nobody's claiming ownership, but there's a lot of people mining. So it all depends on y your area. So, you know, throw 100 in, see what happens over a day times that by seven and you'll kind of have a general idea of if it would be worth it to you. Wow, you are still watching the video. Jeez, I am so sorry the video is so long. I have tried to cut it down a bunch of times and I'm not very good at it apparently. So if you're still watching, thank you so much. I really hope the video has helped you out even a little bit. Um, if it has at all, please like, subscribe, all that sort of stuff means a ton. Uh, this channel, everything I make does go 100% to charity. So absolutely, every time you like and subscribe, it, it goes a very long way. Super appreciate it. And I guess the rest of the this video, I'm just gonna ramble real quick and just kind of one-on-one -on -one touch base with you real quick and uh, hopefully it won't be too long, but um, uh, but my last video, you see, it got like 5,000 um, likes, um, sorry, uh, views, and I got like 250 subscribers, and um, I don't know why getting likes and subscribes is so, such so appealing, and so like, every time I get a new comment or a new like or subscribe, it definitely means a lot, so like, thank you so much for, for everyone supporting. These videos do take a long time, and I, I hate every video I ever post, I think it's crap, and so... Uh, when you guys don't think it's crap, it makes me want to make more and do better, and uh, and hopefully I have in this video. But before I let you go, I kind of wanted to one-on-one -on -one with you and talk to you about this industry and this space because this industry and space is so dishonest and shady and crappy. There's so many crappy people, and I just want um, people to be aware and careful. With those 5,000 views and subscribes, it made me, made me think like, wow, how many of you are brand new into this space how many of you um, don't know anything about this space at all and how many are investing tons of money into companies that you're just going to get ripped off at you have people claiming guaranteed returns and uh, people claiming to be the next Bitcoin and all, all that sort of stuff so um, so I just want people to be very 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 careful what you invest and if you can't throw your money away um, with what you invested if you invest a thousand bucks bucks a hundred bucks ten thousand bucks and that money disappears forever um, the next day, you need to be okay with that. And if you're not, don't invest that much. Um, because I understand, trading your time, most of the people watching this video, you are trading your time for money. Um, meaning you spend eight months of your work saving up money and then you take that money and invest in it. And you know, if that stock crashes, if that, you know, whatever investment you end up doing disappears, um, I understand how it can be devastating. and and scary um, and 
yeah, I, I, I know what that feeling is of losing thousands, um, you know, multiple thousands. I, I remember refreshing on one of my accounts and it was like, every time I refreshed, I lost like a hundred bucks for, for like, I don't know, you know, 30, 40 minutes. And it was like, ah, so uh, I get it. And I just want people to be very, very, very careful. Now, I don't want to say the XYO is a scam or anything like that, but there is some like red flags when it comes to it that people should just be aware of. Um, and, and some things I, I just wish they'd be more upfront about. And uh, for example, let's just talk about XYO specifically since this is what we're talking about in this video. Um, but like, for example, ads. Man, they have so many ads that they end up uh, running. And there's one ad where they actually have like a physical Bitcoin miner with the coin app logo and they're like, oh, here, you can mine crypto. And it makes it look like you can mine Bitcoin uh, for just this $12 device and it's really misleading. And people that don't know the space don't understand that what they're doing and it just makes people not like crypto. And so I wish they would be more upfront when it came to their advertising. It doesn't mean that the company's bad, it just means maybe that one of their marketers is just a idiot and you know, who knows. Um, but you know, also, um, you know, I just have an issue with these paid programs. Like really, you're gonna make me pay 25, 35 bucks to mine crypto. And if you looked at, watch my video, you'll notice like you have to make, what is it like 1100 coins or something like that um, in order to make it worth on a 24. And like, uh, I don't remember what it was, 1500. I don't know what, I can't remember, it's in the video. But it, it's gonna, you essentially like need to be driving nine plus hours every single day, which not many people do. And so it just, uh, and, and they're not very upfront, I guess, on where these where the money goes. Uh, if you look at their roadmap, it pretty much stops at what the last thing they did was. Um, you don't really know what their five-year, you know, ten-year plan is. What you know exactly what's going on? It's a bunch of general terms. And so normally, this is the stuff you need to be aware, scared of, and um, and um, you know. So and then also, for example, the. Um, the, the membership that you end up paying for, you don't even need a Sentinel. So it's like, cool, you're gonna make me pay 25 bucks, you're gonna make me buy these Sentinels. Um, some people spent 400 bucks on like eight Sentinels and a bridge, but you can just download a Sentinel. You can, your phone can be used as a Sentinel and a bridge, so you don't need to get any physical product whatsoever. So what's the point of paying for all those devices? Uh, you know, uh, why is it so much? Like, there's all these questions. They raised $11 million for their ICO. Uh, the, the market cap is currently $6 million for the entire coin. So, like, um, there are a lot of question marks when it comes to this company that people just need to be aware of. So, you know, and I, I kind of am okay with talking about this company because it's twelve ninety five. who cares, or 60 bucks. Like, it's not like people are gonna die or not be able to feed their family because of a $12.95 purchase so um, but just understand um, the risks again anybody who has liked and subscribed thank you so much if you have any questions whatsoever <coughs> put a comment down below if you end up subscribing to my channel just know I will post f future projects of things I'm interested in things I'm doing uh, I also do a lot of stuff outside of crypto as well I think my channel will probably move towards all sorts of investment but I'm obsessed with cryptocurrency so the majority of it will be crypto um, so at any rate I guess that's it um, you guys have no idea how much I appreciate your, your comments and your, your vibes that you give out um, I have a hard time posting these videos because I don't like sharing my face. I don't like, I just, I don't know. I, I guess I need to be more secure about myself, but thank you so much again, everybody. And I hope you have a fantastic day and I will see you at the next video. Take care. Bye.